Hey, what's up everyone? It's me again, Matt of TechOnSite. Here's a quick video on how to install the firmware of uh, Viltrox 85mm for Fuji. So let's get right into it. Okay, so it's uh, very important to update the firmware of a camera because uh, it has the, the new firmware has more features and uh, sometimes uh, there are some uh, uh, improvements for, for the lens, especially for autofocus. Now for uh, the Viltrox 85 millimeter, this is the Mark II version. So there was a uh, firmware released uh, after um, uh, this was officially launched in production. So last uh, March 2021, last year, so there was an improvement on the Mark II for 85 millimeter for Fuji. All right, so um, on the uh, Viltrox website, um, I went to the uh, Viltrox.com uh, en for English, and I went to download, and then um, I searched for the uh, lenses for Fuji, which is under APS-C XF uh, mount, and uh, yeah, I searched for the AF, which is autofocus 85 millimeter 1.8. XF Mark II. So the most current version is the version 1.09. And this uh, firmware update was released uh, March 10, 2021. And these are the firmware um, um, update instructions or uh, the feature of this new firmware. It fixed the issue of occasional uh, splash screen. Um, it updated the, um, the, it improved the stability and it adjusted the clo uh, closest focusing distance. So that's very important. And um, most importantly, it optimized the focusing speed. All right. So uh, it's pretty much easy to upgrade the uh, firmware of uh, Viltrox. Um, obviously, you would need uh, the lens itself and you would need a uh, micro uh, USB. All right. So unfortunately, this is not yet uh, on uh, USB-C. So all you have to do is remove the cap and um, install the micro USB to the computer and it will be detected as a, um, as a drive. And all you have to do, once you have downloaded the firmware, you just have to drag and drop the uh, firmware um, to the um, uh, to the drive that that was mounted. Okay, so let's try to uh, check it. Okay, let me connect the um, the Viltrox eighty five millimeter to the computer. There you go. So it was detected now and. It's on my other screen, so there you go. So first, uh, this is the uh, the DAT file is the current firmware, and under uh, the dot, uh, dot txt or the device information, um, when you open it, it will open in Notepad, and you would see the software version um, of uh, of the um, lens. So on on my lens, I've already updated it, so I'll just basically simulate it. So it's already on uh, version 1.09, but um, anyway, uh, what the heck, we can uh, do it again. So once you've downloaded it, you just have to um, simply drag and drop it. So let me download it. And I think I've already downloaded the file. It's under on uh, the, my F drive and then firmware. Viltrox 85 millimeter and um, yeah so you just have I just have to drag and drop this to the um, Viltrox uh, folder All right so let me launch again all right so the Viltrox is this one um, Viltrox DFU so again so this is the DAT file and uh, you just have to drag and drop it like this. And um, it would copy it. It would um, uh, disappear. And uh, it will come back again with the updated version. And you can check it if, if it was successful by 
uh, opening this uh, deviceinformation.txt and ensure that it's on the version that you've uh, downloaded. All right, so there you go, guys. It's very uh, quick and easy to install the uh, the firmware for the Viltrox um, 85 millimeter for Fuji. Actually, it's across all Vit Viltrox um, lenses. You just have to um, download the right uh, version and um, uh, do the same process. So there you go, guys. If you find this um, um, uh, video uh, helpful, please hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.